Jacinda Ardern. Uh, Mr Speaker, uh, I'm going to be very brief. Um, because on this side of the House, we're still optimistic that if the government does indeed support this bill, they'll see it pass tonight. Uh, my comments I want to restrict to only really uh, three things. First, my thanks to Tracy Martin, because even though, as she is so um, humbly and eloquently put, she doesn't consider this bill to be hers, every bill needs a champion, and she's been an excellent champion. So I, I thank her for her work. Um, we've got to acknowledge people like Di Vivian and grandparents raising grandchildren for their work and their advocacy. And yes, this has had long history. No one's denying that. Uh, but we owe it to them to, to move swiftly on something uh, such uh, as important as this. And finally, um, the, the small lost opportunities that we've had, uh, we haven't quite achieved parity with this bill. If we were achieving parity, we would extend to uh, those who are receiving the unsupported child benefit all of the special allowances that a foster carer receives, and there are more than just a clothing allowance. We will continue to campaign for all of those additional benefits to be received until absolute parity is reached. Uh, and finally, uh, it is not uh, Tracy Martin's fault that this isn't coming until 2018. Uh, she absolutely did her best. There have been many reasons given on that side of the House as to why it's been delayed. I don't think any of them stack up. Uh, 2018, that government might not even be in office. So at least we can give this guarantee. Uh, it is our intention that we will be in office and we absolutely guarantee it will be implemented as soon as we reach office. Um, that, is, that is the guarantee that we give. Uh, and the reason why I'm still so disappointed that we are waiting that long, uh, Mr Speaker, is because all of us received these letters and these images from children asking for us to put this through immediately. And I'll leave the, my final words uh, to the note I received that said I'm nearly five years old. Please do not make me wait till 2018 for the closing allowance. Grandma and Grandad are on a pension. I don't even think they should have to wait more than tonight. I call Mac Ducey.